guys I am back with a, another video this is a full face makeup tutorial using the L'Oreal infallible pro glow foundation on my eyes I will be using the urban decay vice 4 palette because I promised you guys a tutorial from one of my last beauty hauls also if you're interested in what I think about this foundation please stay tuned for the end of this video first I'm starting out with primer and I'm just priming my face my face has already been um, washed and my brows have been done as you guys can see now I'm starting with my foundation I'm using the L'Oreal Pro Glow foundation in the color 211 and now I'm adding the color 212 211 is creme cafe 212 is cocoa and I'm mixing these two colors together to get my perfect match now I'm using my beauty blending sponge spraying it with a little makeup setting spray and applying the foundation oops I forgot to color correct <laughs> now I'm using my orange color corrector around my mouth and underneath my eyes to cancel out any darkness that I may have and also you guys I will leave all the products that I'm using in the description box at the bottom of this video and as you can see I'm just blending that foundation into my skin Okay guys, so now I'm taking some concealer and I'm going on the inner and outer portion of my eyelid just to cancel out any discoloration. Now I'm priming the eyelid, preparing it for the eyeshadow. Now I'm taking this light brown color and I'm putting that into my transition area and sweeping motions back and forth. Now I'm taking the Vice 4 palette and I'm going to be taking this orange color and I'm going to go underneath the transition and into the crease area. Now I'm taking an eyeshadow base and I'm carving out my eyelid. I have hooded eyes, which means I have extra skin in between my eyelid and crease. So I'm carving out my eyelid to make it appear bigger. Now going back into the Vice 4 palette, I'm gonna be using this beautiful green color. And it's a really, really popping, as you guys can see on top of this eyeshadow base. And I really like that. Now I'm gonna blend out any harsh lines with a clean blending brush. Now I'm going into this brown color and I'm just blending all of the colors together. Now I'm just making sure that everything is blended. And I'm going into this dark gray color and going into my outer V to create a smoky eye. And then I'm just going to blend all of that together. Now I'm putting on my eyeliner. And now y'all I'm taking that green color and I'm going underneath the waterline just in the front portion. And then I'm going to get that dark gray color and go underneath the waterline on the outer portion of my eye. And y'all, I did put on lashes and um, eyeliner on top off camera. But I'll, I'll leave that information below at the bottom of the video. Alright guys, as you can already see, I am highlighting my under eye. I'm using some concealer that is a shade lighter than my shade of foundation that I wear. And I just applied it underneath my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, my forehead, cupid's bow, and chin. And I'm just blending that out. You have to blend, 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 blend for your life. Seriously, blend and get all those harsh lines out. And as you can see, I'm using my foundation brush to make sure that I blend it good. And now I'm just setting all of those areas with powder. And now I'm going around all the other areas of my face with foundation powder. And now... I'm just kind of carving out my cheeks a little bit, bronzing it up with some ebony bronzer. And now I am contouring my nose. And now I'm sweeping all of that powder off. Sweeping, sweeping, sweeping it off. Now I am applying a little blush. I absolutely love to apply lots of blush. <laughs> and now I am just highlighting my cheeks the bridge of my nose and on top of my cupid's bow and now I'm lining my lips with a dark brown lip liner and putting on a nudish pinkish color and setting my face and this is the final look you guys I hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial now here are my thoughts on this L'Oreal Pro Glow foundation hey y'all I just wanted to come to you guys and let you know what I thought about this foundation after wearing it all day I hope that you guys enjoyed the tutorial that I did um, I applied my makeup then around 8 30 and it is now 
336 so yeah it has been seven hours since I have applied the makeup and as you can see it still looks pretty good I think so I haven't like put any powder on it the only thing I've done is reapply my lipstick because I ate I ended up having to mix both of these colors to get my color which I kind of didn't like come on L'Oreal come out with more colors for women of color but overall I do like this foundation I like the way that it turned out it was kind of orange at first you guys probably saw that in the video even after I mixed it with a yellow base foundation but after it oxidized and I put my powder on and everything I think it looks pretty good so let me tell you guys what this makeup is supposed to do it's supposed to be a 24 hour foundation it's supposed to give a radiant finish and it's for normal or dry skin and it's supposed to be hydrating so as far as that part goes I think that it is a radiant foundation um, I do feel like it has like a glowy look to it but then it kind of looks dewy too so I don't know if I would just call it a glowy foundation okay, on the back it says that it can be worn up to 24 hours and it has medium coverage so I would agree with that um, the 24 hour part I don't know because I only wore it seven hours and then as far as the texture it says it's supposed to be air light I will agree y'all I swear I feel like I don't even have any foundation on like it is super super lightweight I got mine from Walmart for ten dollars and I think 97 cents so I ended up paying like twenty dollars when I could have paid ten if they would have had more varieties for women of color how would I rate this I give this foundation a thumbs up because if it can still look like this seven hours later I think that's good I mean I am kind of shiny around here a little bit and here but these are the places where I have most problems anyway with um, my foundations later on in the day so I really like this foundation y'all I mean I really do I hope that you guys enjoy my thoughts my makeup tutorial on this look as always please remember to like comment and subscribe follow me on Instagram at Miss Beauty to you one follow me on snapchat at Miss Beauty to you one and don't forget to thumbs up and just let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this I want to start doing more makeup tutorials and reviews on products so if you like videos like this please comment down below if you got some ideas or some more type of videos that you want to see from me just let me know down below in the comment section okay all right guys I'll see you on the next video Bye.